Warmer weather will soon be here, and folks may be doing some burning outdoors. Emily Deem is learning the safe way to burn. She joins us live from Swamico. Good morning, Emily. Hey, Rach. Good morning to you. Hi, everybody. Yeah, you're probably outside right now. Beautiful morning we have out here in Swamico. Maybe doing a little yard work. We're going to burn some debris this morning. What's considered debris is, you know, sticks, leaves, needles, stuff like that. And I'm throwing this debris in a campfire pit. And you may think, well, hey, that's for campfires. No, the DNR says it's not where you burn, it's why you burn. So John Lovers is here with me this morning with the Wisconsin DNR. Um, one thing really too, burning permits is what we're talking about this morning. We're actually in a township. That is where John lives in Suamico. Um, this is regulated by the township. There are other counties regulated by the DNR. So tell me what your burning permit requires here in Suamico. Okay, here in Suamico, in the village of Suamico, the, the, the debris burning permit uh, limits me to burning again uh, sticks and needles and uh, leaves and that sort of thing and in Swamico here it requires me to burn during the daytime hours that that's different from where uh, DNR regulates burning and where we, does the DNR regulate we, we regulate burning mostly uh, west of here in, in northern Wisconsin you can think of it generally in those terms along the lakeshore area uh, the villages or the townships regulate burning. Okay, so we have our debris here. How are we being safe and burning this safely? Okay, uh, same concepts as with a campfire though. You know, you've got a nice cleared area here. We've got the tools. I've got my water here with me. And again, I'm keeping this small and we're, we're feeding the debris onto this fire from a larger pile. We're not burning a big pile at once because that's, that's harder to control. What's illegal to burn? Okay, uh, any kind of household garbage plastics, rubber, those types of things, materials like that, that, that really have noxious smoke and, and, and the ash is really uh, nasty because of the chemicals and things inside those things. So, so yeah, garbage, that sort of thing. And your burning permit costs five bucks in the township, but with the DNR, it's free. Tell us where people can get their burning permits. Okay, uh, a DNR permit, you can, you can go online and pick up the permit and print it off right at your house. You, or you can uh, call toll free uh, the number we have and they'll mail you one. Uh, you can go to an emergency fire warden if you want to do it that way and pick up a burning permit there. Here in the village of Swamico, I go to the village hall and they issue me my burning permit there. So pretty easy way and it's all just wildfire prevention. That is why people need to get these burning permits. That's right, right. When you get the permit, it'll give you some safety uh, tips, how to burn safely, what to burn, what not to burn, that sort of thing, all in the effort to prevent wildfires. Great. Thank you so much, John. Great information this morning. Hey, and if you want to see uh, that number or if you want the link, we've set it up on our website at fox11online.com, so you can just click on Good Day Wisconsin tab. We'll send it back to you. Appreciate it. Thank you.